Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this video today. I hope you enjoy and you get some inspiration and great ideas from our little remodel and that you can take away from this some organizational skills and labeling and things like that to help your system in your laundry room be more sufficient for you and just work a lot better for your home and your family. And I hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up. husband and I decided we wanted to do a little bit of changes because if you see there is top is removable if you can tell there's two by fours holding it up on each side and then I do like how this is kind of flush or hangs over the washer and dryer because then it gives me more room to fold laundry on um, we'll sit on so there are still some things that I want to change in here, but I'm going to do later. <laughs> are you licking your kitty book? Okay, you guys, so we got the cabinet moved up. Our battery died to our drill, but we got it up. Now look at how much space we have right here. 
And we're gonna put the shelf, I think we're gonna take this countertop out after we measure so we can install it. But it looks good already, I'm so excited. Okay you guys, so I just wanted to film another clip to show you what else I have added here. So you guys, I have this because I sit my coffee cup right here so that I can drink coffee in the morning while I am folding my clothes. But I wanted to show you, I repainted this. It was like a green color and I absolutely love it. My husband thought I bought a new one, but so I list things that are for the laundry room that I need to restock. And then I finally got these labels from Target. They're from Home Essentials, love them. I think I actually... So I just wanted to finish, you guys. Sorry, my battery died and I didn't realize it was dying. So anyways, um, I just wanted to show you a little bit more stuff that I did. This was like a goldish color and I repainted it white. And then um, I labeled these from I got these little labels from Hobby Lobby and I did these too I'm eventually I'm gonna paint these bottles white and then sand them and do like a farmhouse kind of style with them but um, I also wanted to show you guys our laundry soap this is still blue because I had old laundry soap in there but I wish I would have rinsed it out now but anyways this is the laundry detergent we just um, switched to I've actually used this a long time ago but I love this because of the smell. This is Magnolia Lily. Um, it has a built-in fabric softener and then it's um, plant-based. So it um, is for sensitive skin and it's the Safer Choice by US EPA. And um, it's earth-friendly product and it also is for high efficient, it's hyper hypoallergenic and this you guys was only five dollars and i am not kidding i got this from costco it we actually bought two or three of them i have them in my food storage downstairs but these this is amazing and i like it because there's no dye it's just plain white um so it's really good and there's my little stinky again hi baby hi I got this rug from Home Depot and I did get some carpet pad to go underneath it but my husband's gonna have to shave the door for me because it won't close when the carpet pads under there because I stand here a lot I just wanted to have like a soft rug with a pad and then I am gonna be moving this behind the door uh, just because I like the ironing board cover, but I don't like the pattern with this pattern like I just it's too busy when I open the door. So anyways, I just wanted to give you guys like a little overview of everything and what it looks like and I think I did show that I got these little baskets from Target to just hold some small things in here. I'm gonna get, um, I have baby wipes in here because if I have any messes to clean up, I like to have baby wipes, but, um, and then I got, I had these already, and then that, I want to get something else for my sewing kit. I've had this for so, so long, and I just love it because you can see through it, but I want to get something else to hold this in, so I'm gonna get some kind of box, something like to hold all this stuff in. And then I also want to get something cuter than Dory for my baby wipe container. So, um, but pretty much everything is complete in here, you guys. I absolutely love this. I unfortunately can't put this in here because the shelf is not tall enough and I can't move it up because then I won't be able to have this stuff. I was thinking I could move the stuff that's taller down here with this and then move that up but then I don't think everything's gonna fit so 
Anyways, I hope you guys like this reveal and it helps you out if you're remodeling your bathroom or I mean your laundry room. Um, it's amazing. I absolutely love doing laundry now.